I mean, Gundy, you're, you're a very influential guy. You have been for, for many years. Has any politician ever tried to sort of get your support? Have they ever courted you for support in the past? Yeah, with, with Trump during inauguration. Really? In what way? What did he do? They offered me a half a million dollars to go. They offered you a half a million dollars, what, to play at the inauguration? No, just to, to come. To just go. to be there? Just to turn up? Wow. Wow. And your response was? I, I, I didn't do it because I didn't know if I could fix the damage. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> to be honest with you, uh, all money is not good money. You got to be careful what you're doing publicly because... It's, it's, I don't know how you fix that thing. Like, I just was like, whoa, bro. Because <laughs> 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 if you do it, don't bring me to fix the African-American, bro. <laughs> bring somebody else. I'll see you later, right, go. I mean, what advice would you give to Senator Warren on how to reach young voters? Just relax. You gotta loosen up and relax. Is that it? Okay, yeah. And then, okay. and then when you stay close to hip hop is connected to youth culture. Uh -huh. So hang out with me when you're the president. Oh. Right. There you go. Got you it. heard it here first.